Welcome back to the channel, everybody. It's September 4th, 2021. We are in the little town of Vail today for the Vail Preservation Society's event. Power from the past is here. And we have tractors and engines. My buddy Arnie's economy, and of course you all recognize the uh, road trip treasure, the little Gibson Model A. We get several guys uh, scrutinizing now as Chalmers Model C. Jerry, what year is your uh, Massey Ferguson 35? 1955. 1955. It's only two years older than me. <laughs> That's not bad, yeah. So she's gas powered, and I assume that's a manure scoop on the front. I think that pivot was probably four. Yeah. I've had it about 15, 20 years. Yes, looking good. Yeah, that's a pretty good one. Good little chore tractor, you bet. Well, that loader frame is sure stout. Yeah. Heavy duty back blade. Three point hitch, got a PTO. And it's got the it's got the perfect patina. Yeah, the, the hood come out of the diesel. Yeah, I saw the diesel deluxe tag, but then I saw it's a gas engine. So. Ah, Continental engine's a good engine. They're good. Real good engine. Yeah, lasts a long time. You bet. Your engine's going to be YouTube famous. So, Daryl, what inspired you to build this thing? This gold winter, uh, gold winter and lots and a scrap pile, right? Well, she's awesome. Very reminiscent of my, of my old contraption. That's creative use of an auger, I will say. McCormick, what uh, what horsepower is it? One and a half horse. Now is this this is throttle governed? Yeah, throttle governed. Okay. Voice the sound is really good. Pause the video to read that if you want. Larry, what's the diameter on that grindstone? What's the diameter on the grindstone? 30 inches. And what is it, six inches wide?
got enough tar to seal up the uh, truck. I got the tar, but it still leaks. Still leaks. <laughs> Got a 1934 Witty, huh? Nice running it. Most of my uh, longtime viewers have seen this before, several videos. The uh, compressor is a modified Model A engine. Two cylinders run the engine, and two cylinders are used for compressing air, which charges the air tank, which is used to uh, start the Westland. Can't were you guys ever to, able to figure out what was wrong with the trip arm over there? Could be something as simple as just the way she's the trailer is sitting, you know. You remember how tall these flywheels are? You remember how tall the flywheels are? Well, they look about at least six feet. <laughs> yeah. Quite an engine. So here's the info on uh, converting a Model A engine into an air compressor. You can pause your video and read that if you choose to. Yeah, we got a few vendors set up here. Burlington, Nor Burlington Northern Santa Fe. Here's a fire pit for you. No event is complete without goats. What are their names, girls? What are their names? So the brown one is Buttercup, and what's the white and black one? Okay. All right. <laughs> So what's this one's and name? I'm sorry. Finn? Finn? I'll be doggone. He looks feisty. Well, for starting music, YouTube don't like that, so I'll pause this. And last but not least is my uh, buddy Jim's tool tray. Those of you familiar with my channel, you'll have seen this featured about oh, several months ago at the Hidden Treasure Mall show. And I gave an inside tour, but I'm not going to do that now because he's got about five or six people crammed in there. And so we'll just leave it at that. So you can go, uh, if I can find it, I'll leave a link in the description uh, for that Hidden Treasure Mall show if you want to see the contents of the Tool Trailer Museum. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you later.